Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, and I'm back with another Dragalia Laws video. That's right, the 1000 Day Celebration info is finally here, so I'm gonna gonna go over it, uh, give some thoughts about it, and that's gonna be today's video. I hope you like it. If you do, you can leave a like, comment, tell me about what you're uh, excited for, and subscribe to me for more video stuff. I will say right now, I am aware of what the data mines are coming. I know what the next banner is. Try not to spoil it for other people because I can't wait for people to- <laughs> I, They should be surprised when they see it if they don't want to know. So I'm going to ask you guys to very kindly try not to spoil who's coming up next. Because I know. It's not a Gala banner. It's something else. But uh, that uh, character will have their proper due when it's the, the time to. So when we actually get info on them and what they do. So let's start. So events in celebration of the Thousand Day Anniversary are on now. They're starting right now. Happy a Thousand Days. Uh, log in during the bonus to get the gifts such as items and warmite. So day one, a thousand warmite. Day two, a thousand gold crystal. Is it literally just a thousand? A thousand warmite gemstones? A thousand amplifying gemstones? Another thousand warmite? A thousand talent stones? A thousand Draenor Aureus, a thousand Leaves, and a thousand Crimson Core, and a thousand... <laughs> I love it. 3,000 Wormite and a whole bunch of other stuff at a thousand. Let's go. Love it. This goes on from 621 to 708. Uh, the Dragalia Lost Trivia Week in the celebration of the Thousand Days anniversary is on now. Uh, so they're holding a trivia week to celebrate the Thousand Day Anniversary, which is, I think, what they did during the anniversary. Each day during the event, 10 followers of either official English or Japanese uh, who tweet their quiz results with the hashtag Jugaylay Lost Trivia Week and Nintendo Contest will randomly select to receive 1,200 Wormites. Uh, very cool. That's lasting for, looks like, five days? Yeah. You can tap here for details. The Dragalia Scratchathon is coming soon. The Dragalia Scratchathon from 704. During this event, log in for a chance to win items in uh, Warmite. If you manage to win a Scratchathon summon, head on over to the summon screen to summon a 5 adventurer. Don't threat if luck isn't on your side, though. If you haven't won a Scratchathon summon by the time the final day rolls around, it's guaranteed. Okay, great. I kind of want to know what what pull of five units are you going to be pulling from but that sounds pretty good especially if you're someone who's brand new uh prize lineup a scratchathon summon uh rupal one million uh exquisite honey five warmite 50 rainbow orbs 25 elder water 1000 champion testament one uh that's going on from 704 to 718 lasting a decent amount and the summon banner will be here i guess until the 29th just so uh you know, you have plenty of time to actually do your summons, if that's what you wish. So that's pretty cool. Uh, the Dragalia Scratchathon prize will be available every day after 11pm when you log in. Dragalia Scratchathon prizes can only be accepted for a limited time. Duplicate adventurers obtained from the Scratchathon summon will be replaced with Eldwater. Yeah, figures. Eldwater, my bad. Each Scratchathon summon session can only be performed once. Multiple sessions will stack for the duration of the event. Daily free tenfold summon and free hundredth summon events are coming soon. This is pretty great. Daily free tenfold summon event, which will allow you to perform a tenfold summon on the applicable summon showcase for free once per day, starts on 704. What's more, there will be a free hundredth multi summon, not multi summon, hundredfold summon event during which you can perform 100 summons on the applicable summon showcase for free. Note that this event will only last for a single day, so don't miss it. So we've got from 704 to 718, that's the daily free tenfolds, and then on 718, uh, 100 summons, which is 10 multi summons, or I guess if you want to be 100 singles, there are 100 singles. So let's see how much multis that is, considering the starting with the first day. So let's start with 704. So we got uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14, so that means 14, that is 140 summons plus the 100 summons. That's 240 summons for free. It's not bad, that's almost enough for a sparking if it was on a single banner, <laughs> but it's not, so. That's great, I love it. Um, the free 100 summon, I really, I'm really curious what banner that's gonna be. I wonder if that's gonna be when it's gonna be a Jugalia remix, maybe? That would be pretty, very nice, but who knows? 
Uh, I kind of wish they gave a little bit more info on it, but we'll see what it is. Because if the 300th multi is like on a like a water focus banner, then uh, it's kind of like who cares. <laughs> Um, but we'll see what banners are when it comes. But right now, either way, buttload of summons, very good. And then finally, a thousand day anniversary upgrade events are now live. Um, events including uh, Double Drop Avenue to Power, Double Drop Avenue to Fortune, Double Drop certain main campaigns starts on 621 and goes right here. You can tap here for details and I'm also positive that they also sent a free multi to anyone to celebrate 1000 days. So if you go into now, you can get uh, a free multi summon. Let me double check on that real quick though, just to be sure. Yep, it's true. Here's the specific post with it on it. All right, so, man, a thousand day celebration. The thing that we don't know yet is what the banners are going to be. So we'll wait and see what banners are going to be coming up. Obviously, we know what the next one is, which I'm not saying because it got data mined super early, which is very unfortunate if you're someone who was, uh, I guess it's only really unfortunate for the people um, who work on the game who are like, oh, yeah, this is a, a very exciting thing. Um but yeah, in terms of everything else coming up, we're just going to have to wait and see. So I'll be very curious about what it's going to be. Technically, I think the next Galadragalia should be a dragon. If I'm remembering that right, it should be a dragon. Um, hmm. But yeah, looks really good. Happy a thousand days, Dragalia. This sounds awesome. This login bonus is just hilarious with the, all the 1000s in it. I love it. Uh, so yeah, here's to a thousand more days in Dragalia, hopefully. And that's gonna be the end of today's video, everyone. I hope you enjoyed it if you did. As always, you can leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I really didn't really mention much of it, but that's because it's like, yo, this is all good. I've already, I've always felt like, um, it kinda sucks because I feel like back in the day, we got a lot more free summons, but it seems like now what they're doing is just like holding it up for big celebrations. So during celebrations, they just go ham, crazy wild. So I'll gladly take it. Um, and also with the Trials of the Mighty free multi that I'm always constantly getting, I feel like we're back to kind of the old days, except for I don't have as many tickets. But, you know, the game has really changed a lot in a thousand days. More than any other gacha that I play, I can think about, like, oh yeah, here's a specific... Most time periods in a gacha are kind of weighed by, um... The units that are inside it, and obviously Dragalia has the, you know, when Cleo was the top unit, was the only unit that you really used. Um... And then there's other obvious metas that go around, too, where it'd be, like, Karina, Cheese, and all that other stuff. Um... Uh, the Korean cheese I feel like didn't last very long. But, the, but what I'm trying to say here is it's very interesting that I can look at specific points in Dragalia and go like, oh yeah, that's when it was like this. The, the brief moment in the beginning of the game where stamina and um, there was no wings, so stamina is how you actually got into co-op stuff. So, a lot of changes, hopefully continuously changing for better and for worse, as always, as time, mar time marches forward. I'll see you guys in the next adventure. You guys have a good day. Peace out. Bye-bye.